Well, the community gathering today to honor the life of the late Sadie Roberts Joseph. Yeah, a legend she was around town. Now, NBC Local 33's Kennedy Walker explains how Roberts Joseph touched the lives of so many people. The work that she's done has had such a big effect on everybody. A mural to honor one of the community's advocates for civil and human rights. It's good to see that people really care. Through the loss, a community comes together to remember Sadie Roberts Joseph. Artist Kristen Downing says she wants to keep her memory alive. The love that she gave me, you know, like welcoming me, welcoming me to Baton Rouge, you know, I just felt like I was the right person for, you know, the job to paint the mural. Downing met Roberts Joseph about a year ago. She says she often thinks about their time together. When I first was opening up my, my own gallery, Miss Sadie came out to one of my mural projects and gave me her blessings. And um, she pretty much, you know, dropped some knowledge to me. 13 year old Brianna Hamner says even though she's young, she knew coming out to support the mural was the right thing to do. I felt like it was just. I was giving back to the community. This was a way to show our appreciation for her. Mayor President Sharon Weston Broom says she believes Roberts Joseph would be honored to know her work didn't go unnoticed. To see people coming together to uh, uplift the community and to use it through uh, art, uh, she would be she would be ecstatic. For NBC Local 33, I'm Kennedy Walker. Kennedy, thank you. Now, if you'd like to take a look at that mural. Just go over to Plank Road near Pawnee Street.